over there. Ah. <laughs> Hit it. Uh, baby girl, swing this mic over here. It's picking up everything over there. <laughs> it is the all new rollout show. It is Wednesday morning. Well, kind of. Lit, kind of. Anyway, it's kind of weird. It's we're all new rollout show right here at Morris Media Studios. It's your boy Speed Doggy Dog, the funniest motherfucker you ever gonna meet. All right, it's the poetess Nikki Pam, and in the building joining us for the day at Mister Nate Jackson on Instagram, Vine, and Twitter. But none of that's important. It's Nate Jackson today. <laughs> okay, cool. I thought you was like your name is at. <laughs> Show you love for at. Want to know where to find me? Off top, at. You still got the car with all the? You already know I'm wrapped. Yeah, I go to the airport. For those who don't know, he's a comedian. Anyway, I go to the airport and uh, did you turn me down? Yeah. Porters? Turn your microphones, uh, your headphones up. I will not. I want you to turn me up, mama. I'm all the way up. I'm on 11. It's only say 10. Uh, so, Nate Jackson, you have a car that's wrapped with your picture and everything on it. Yeah, man. When I was an undergrad um, at Florida Memorial College in Miami, we used to go to South Beach and I seen Ace Hood with like four vans wrapped. And I told myself then, like, if I ever get enough bread, I'm uh, wrapping my car. And, and how many how many gigs have you gotten from wrapping your car? Uh, it's, it's one of them things where it's like intangible. You don't you don't necessarily know. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? But we're talking about it now, so it works. Yeah, yeah. You go to the airport. I just happened to go to the airport one day. And I'm parking, and I see your car parked at the airport. And I'm like, hey, I know him. Yeah, I'm wrapped up. Yeah. And what they did a little thing. Is they it put a van or a car? No, it's a uh, Chevy Malibu. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a regular they, car. They act it up, man, because the people that wrapped it, they used to, they do fleets. So they used to doing like US West or AT and T vans. Yeah. So when they had just one dude, they 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 went nuts for me. Like they wrapped the windows. I didn't I didn't have to pay for none of that. The windows, they put a uh, a little plastic container on the. It's they stuck it to the trunk and it holds business cards and it says take a card over it. So even when I'm not in the whip, people can. What take about when it rains? It stays dry. It's in the little case. Oh, shit, I didn't notice that. I showed it. I was like, what is this? They pulled it off. I act like a little kid on Cribs or something. <laughs> <laughs> the exhibit could have been telling me, this is your ride. <laughs> you been... What did they go? Uh, pimped. P- you yeah, been pimped. Pimped they grab your ride. Shirt. You been pimped. Yeah. <laughs> Pop my collar. Here's a buzz in the thing, but fuck it, we'll get to it later. Why? I don't know why it's a buzz, but... I don't I don't hear it. Probably because... Yeah, um, we do too. There it is. I fixed it. Oh, that's beautiful. Just the bullshit. Yes. Everything makes sense. Now, now I see why you said to turn down the... Uh, yeah, this sounds phenomenal, Speedy. So Nate was on <laughs> Nate was on the show with me, and uh, God damn, I hit the table. Yeah, there you go. Don't hit the table. Yeah, uh, Nate was on. <laughs> Don't <laughs> shake. I sit in my lap. <laughs> <laughs> right. He's on the show with me in uh, in uh, Oceanside. Yeah, that was fun. And it was off the chain, bro. That was fun, man. Yeah, that, was, that was a lot of fun. Every time I do shows like that, and I wonder why we don't get this shit on the road because we niggas a kill, <laughs> given opportunity. Man, listen, yeah. there's a lot of questions I got with why things ain't the way they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ain't, ain't nobody going to put us out there, man. We got to go. Yeah, That's okay. Right. You got to do it for That's yourself. That's what it comes down to, man. You want to build I, it. I tried that. You got to do it like Bernie Sanders, man. It got to be grassroots. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all just want to get Bernie in the van Sanders. and go. Yeah, I think we should just do it. We need a sponsor. Actually, the George Lopez and them, they don't have book dates. Like, they just, they, he said it's infinite. Like, when, you know. They just gonna keep doing it until they stop. But that's well, that's every comic. George Lopez. Wow. Nah, we all got wow. dates. Wow. <laughs> no, I probably I probably got more shows than George. Uh, than the day. Just, <laughs> Nate, but all your shows add up to one show. Anyway, uh, yeah, that's me all, too. But I'm too, saying too, that no, I, I'm not even gonna take it. But quantity wise, I got hella more shows than George. He's chilling. <laughs> yeah. I'm working. I'm like six oh, nights a week. Okay. <laughs> Slanging these little two jokes. <laughs> Look on your bike. I'm here. <laughs> right. We're gonna boom boy. No, nah, we can do it, Speedy. Let's just go, man. Yeah, that's Let's all y'all go. gotta do. Just I've already go. put together one national tour, man. You oh, remember back when we did Fox Hall? It was me, BT, Clayton, yeah. and Keisha Hunt. And we were trying to get the satellite mic and just be calling in. Yeah. It was cool. Where'd you guys go? Bro, we did 52 cities. We hit Damn. the road. Name two. Uh, nigga, Albuquerque, New Mexico, and. Like comedy clubs? Yeah, we did club shows, whatever. So, Every promoter was like, look, what y'all got? Give us your budget for three weeks and. You know what I'm saying? No shit. Yeah, I'm not bullshitting. Let's we, do it, we, it was going so good, we had to decide to stop. At one point, it was like, nigga, we'll never go home. Oh, okay. Our bills were getting paid. You feel me? So well, I need my bills paid because it's kind of bad right now. Eh? But our ends got, was meeting. We got the kids we, working. When we left, we was like, we might starve. But halfway through, I was like, I'm, I'm paid up. <laughs> 
No, I would love to do it. We'll sit down and talk about it. It, it is Wednesday. Uh, we call it Weird Wednesday. That's what we call it. Pam, how's, how weird is it for you? Did you get some? Did you get some from yesterday? Why do you care, Speedy? I'm worried about you, baby girl. Don't be worried. I'm good. You're dickless in L.A., and that's hard to be dickless. You can say, like, dickless is, like, sleepless in Seattle, yeah. nigga. You can't be dickless in L.A. Niggas slang a dick all day. Yeah, but, you know, I'm good. I'm very good. Thank you good you. like you got some dick, or you good like you're good content without it? A little bit of both. Huh. Mm. <laughs> so you just go home, pull the cover up on you, and just go to sleep? Yeah, mm. Pretty much. The hell? As fine as you are, ain't nobody knocking on that door? Uh, there is somebody knocking There's on the door. There's flag football, but he's he hasn't. He's just busy. It's, oh, let me Visited get you caught up. In a while. I was like, flag football. Her boyfriend actually. plays flag football on, on football Sunday. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, on football Sunday. Physically himself. Yeah. He so got, he's not sitting and watching the game. He's no, like. He's got a team. Nigga, you cool my flag. Now he's not he's not a receiver. <laughs> okay. Not a running back. Quarterback. Not the quarterback. Okay, he's a lineman? He's a lineman. Hmm. He blocks. That's How the, that, Speedy paid that up. He don't. That's the only person getting contact. <laughs> <laughs> Are y'all active? Is that the problem? Yeah, we're 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 good. Yeah. Are y'all fucking? Yes, we are, but we haven't it's in a minute. Talk. But they, they I think we're just over yesterday, so you know we're good. He was have over guys... yesterday. Uh huh. We didn't and... have sex. We you didn't we pull just, his dick out. We ate <laughs> each other. You didn't pull his dick out. No. <laughs> you ain't had no dick, and you just didn't give me that. I need that. No. Have y'all fucked since Sunday? No. No. So this nigga been they physical done it with in, other men in a couple more than months. You? <laughs> <laughs> this nigga literally been locked up with other men. <laughs> with other men. I'll come back to you talking about let's just look at each other and let's just Netflix let's and chill. Eat. I'm like, it's hot in here. <laughs> look, you warming up. You got me off. Hey, man. Look, what, when last time you had some, uh, bro? Uh, shit, when did I just Nigga's knocking uh, down. How do you ask a guy that? He the homie. I That's how the homie. Nigga, when did I tell you? I didn't fuck him, down. shit. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but you got to say it the right way. Hey, nigga, when did I tell you knocked the bitch down? Yeah, right. When you take some of these hoes down. Um, <laughs> Why? Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think. Uh, less than, it was less than two weeks ago. Oh, okay. What, you know, your was it a constant or was it a toss-up? No, nah, none of my pussy is constant. I work too hard. Oh, okay. So you can't be I told shit. you six nights a week. When am I getting some pussy? Where? So it's one of them nights in the comedy club where they go, he was funny, really? Nigga, like, after <laughs> the old door open, I'm standing, she's in the car looking like she's looking for something, sex? That bullshit? Oh, she played it off? <laughs> like, I can't find I, my just phone. Find my, yeah, pat, 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 pat. Yeah. <laughs> in the rap vehicle? Nigga, comics know hell. No, nigga, I don't ever. You don't fucking <laughs> rap? Not in the rap, nigga. <laughs> yeah, no. People are like, nigga, I see you fucking a bitch with your face like seven times. Nah. But it's, the windows are tinted with the rap. Nah. The windows ain't tinted. You can see me in that bitch. Oh, okay. I thought it was tinted. Okay. No, nah, man. I can't cheat or nothing in that. I just call side bitches yeah. like, open your garage. I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> yeah, you can't park Slide right in. Why your car over at Charlene's house? Exactly. Yeah, Hilarious. You know, well, he just said you find in the mother, maybe. Yeah, because I'm not going to play black football. <laughs> going straight for guts. No, seriously, Pam. Why, do you, why, why haven't you guys been active? Uh, just... He timing. was there last night? Does he listen yeah, to the show? Yes, he does. Nigga, get your shit together and come fuck this beautiful black woman right. <laughs> Before, oh, mm. one of the homies beat it up. Yeah, before you be getting after. <laughs> She's beautiful. She after got pretty back. teeth. Oh, thank you. Big ass clean pink tongue, too. You straight, you be, <laughs> she be brushing her tongue, nigga. That's what I like. He said I'll be brushing. Yeah. He said a big ass clean pink tongue. Yeah, she been scraping that motherfucker. She got that shit off the... Uh, yeah, you got to take the back of your toothbrush. got to have a little bristle. Yeah, she got something. She's using a spoon or something. I have an electronic toothbrush. Is that know? what it is? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, your head don't she stink. She likes something vibrating like in her mouth. Yeah. <laughs> she likes yeah. shit moving around in her mouth. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Hilarious. Yeah, hit the back tonsils. That's so what you gotta go for. Is, has he at least initiated? Yeah, have you got a kiss? Yeah, yeah. Oh, they uh -huh. kiss all the time. Mm -hmm. They do all that. You or can tell they do all of that or shit. Whatever. We just ate yesterday. Hold hands. This is be holding hands. She getting affection. She's not yeah. getting dick. <laughs> I'll be getting dick this weekend. I'm good. Shit. This Why don't you just get a little pieces? Just get a little D today, a little I tomorrow. <laughs> Let's see, little K. You got some dick throughout the week. <laughs> no, well, I have to put this in there. So the last time she got it, he hit it with the four-hour session, but he had never he did that before. Oh, and we all went. Oh, blue pill. Nah. Oh, you think it, it took a Viagra? That's what he said. He's only done a four-hour session one time. What the fuck is a four-hour session? 
be, you know, be descriptive. It's, 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 you know, long, and then you you stop a little bit, and then you go back at it, mm-hmm. and you go back at it, you know, that type of thing. But how many, how many nut busts? <laughs> for me, it was 2.5. For him? For him, I think What's it was What's the point two. five? Like, like almost there, one, but like, it didn't like get. Like a little one. He got up. Oh, you got one. Come on, where are you going? <laughs> right. Yeah, that type was of thing. Was it one of those, like, if you would have just, like, three more strokes, nigga, exactly. shit. Exactly. First of all, your pussy's broken, okay? Four <laughs> hours should have been hella more nuts than two and a half. <laughs> Man, shit. You got to use it. It's a muscle, baby. The more you use it, the more it starts re- reacting to what's happening to it. Mm. Just rub it right now while we on this. <laughs> Just warm up the oven. I can't believe it. Uh, preheat your pussy. Yeah. Go ahead pussy is a magnificent thing. Why would you sit on it and let it just dry up? It might not be dry. It's probably ridiculous, but. Hilarious. It's probably juicy. The nerve endings is like, nigga, are we even nerve endings anymore? <laughs> He's here. Fuck Four him. hours? I was toe up. I ain't gonna lie. Four hours? I was like, Lord, I hope he don't want none the next day. Hell he no. ain't had nothing said. You needed a week to heal. Exactly. He was all swollen and shit, sitting on packs of peas. <laughs> packs of peas. He had frozen food and shit. <laughs> Hand me the packs of peas out of there. I got to sit on this because I just got dang. <laughs> he all you got off. left is a cucumber in your free. Bring that. <laughs> Bring whatever you got. Bring you showing people your pussy. Is it damaged? Shit. <laughs> I ain't going to the doctor. They charge. But just look at this side of it. Pam, are you blushing? <laughs> He's cracking Hell me yeah. up. Yeah. Uh, Sit. Sit up, sweetie. Hey, you always try to pin me You do out. live around the corner from each other. Yeah, we do, actually. Pam, does yeah. your shirt have shoulder pads? I know. It looks... No, it doesn't. Uh, God damn. She got on her... She got on, I did. She got on her boyfriend's <laughs> flag outfit. Exactly. That's his flag football outfit. This is Ray Lewis. This is big. Sit up here next to Dwight Howard. <laughs> I don't know how to dance. I don't know how to shoulder lean. No. <laughs> shoulder lean. <laughs> Yo, girl, why you... I used to date this girl who was really tall. Uh-huh. We went to the gym one time. <laughs> they was like, who you got? Her, nigga, shit. Who else are you little niggas? She was like six feet, but she was tall. <laughs> We're picking teams? Yeah. That's funny, But nigga. she can actually play. Like, who you got? Own chick? Uh, got like, let me get Big Bird. Let me get Big <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, get in the paint. <laughs> Leave your nails alone. Get in the paint. <laughs> That's funny. But, uh, Pam, I hope you get some. I'm just... Time. I am. I'm gonna be good this weekend. Trust. So y'all work. Y'all said you talked about it. Like, yo, it's gonna happen mm-hmm. this weekend. Yeah. Okay. He said it's gonna happen. We both did. Yeah. Do you feel like you're gonna be good uh, this weekend, regardless? I don't want that kind regardless. of pussy. He like this. Is the last weekend, I'm gonna go like this. So whether absolutely. it's you or the next nigga, yeah, I, I don't absolutely. want that kind of pussy. Where, where we plan it. It's something you have to I need, sometimes. I need, no. I need to plan it, and I want unplanned pussy. I want somebody to just, just grab my dick while I'm walking through the limb room. That's the shit. What? Yeah, that's a surprise. You got my midriff on, so you just. Oh, Lord. That's why I wear the midriff so you can go on. The fuck is a midriff? <laughs> yes, waist, I got a little waistline. I got like nine waistline <laughs> shirts that come right to the waist. Okay. It just don't it don't hide nothing. You don't have no pants on in the crib? No. Nah. So you just poo bearing? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Is that around? what it's called? Pretty much. Yeah, you ain't got no bottoms on. <laughs> Pooh bear. You don't have no bottoms. That's on right. Pooh bear. Yeah. Snack it in the motherfucker. Ain't oh it? Well, this nigga can't talk. Talk about people through the window with your dick out and I they can't I see. Think about that. Pooh bear is naked that's in the so motherfucker. True. Yes. No shit. That's it's, what you so be doing. It. Yeah. When I'm at the house, nigga, just me and Not, my wifey. Oh, okay. Because I was like, no that, Jonathan that, running around. No, I can't have the kids running around. Are y'all with that? Like, ladies, like that random ass just Talk grab your pussy type shit? Here. I can't try um, if, Yeah, if it's my man, nah, I wouldn't mind. See, she liked the Pooh Bear look. What if it wasn't your man? What if it was what somebody you was just interested in? Get, uh, somebody I'm interested in. Like, you're like, Depends how interested. It. Like, he came over for dinner and he t- immediately took his pants off. That has happened to me. <laughs> and what happened? Did you no, I looked up and he nigga? was completely naked. And did you, you join him? Uh, no. So you was embarrassed bullshit. to do? Did you? Oh, that nigga it was our first out. date. Hilarious. Oh, it did. Did. Did I... showed you his birthmarks and you didn't give him no pussy? <laughs> 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 showed you his beginnings? Nigga. The... Mm-mm. Did you... What did you say? We. So he get naked, you go, nah, I'm good. Yeah, pretty, I know she did. Oh, I didn't even put my quiet. shit back on. I'd have just grabbed my shit and got in the car butt ass naked and went home. <laughs> nigga, I'd have been like, so. You know, he probably, I was at his house. I'm just saying, though, you, he was probably like, I'm going to pull these motherfuckers off. She's going to see this shit and give me that. Yeah. he take all his shit. That out. You went, no. That's why you got to take her small? clothes off before you take yours off. Was Ellis. he small? Is that what it was? No. Well, what happened? It just, I just met him. The fuck? 
Are all of y'all stingy? Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you mean you just met them? Because it was two. It's him and the dick. And, right. I don't we know your dick that way. We ended up, we're still friends to this day. But I ended up giving him some, but I made him wait because I felt like he was too arrogant. The fuck? He got to humble himself to get, to get some pussy? Uh, youngster trying to get <laughs> you pounds. Yeah, you trying, trying to get, get that. That's some bullshit. You ain't got to humble a nigga just to get... Yeah. I hope he fucked you terribly, too. <laughs> I hope he came really fast. Let me tell you something, ladies. All of this, having sex on your time gives you the worst dick ever. If yeah. a nigga grab you, let that nigga fuck with all the beast that's raging through his veins. <laughs> let that nigga get that strong ass, I've been waiting on this pussy nut. Don't wait until he's like, am I going to get this pussy nut? Like, it's not the same. Hilarious. You want a nigga ferocious in your ass. <laughs> it wouldn't have been four hours if you didn't make that nigga wait so long. Yeah. That's what he, four and hours. Like, I'm not going to do that ever. It. That nigga come like, well, no, he's not trying to take his blue pill. He, Shut up, sweetie. Trust I, I'm honestly impressed. The nigga fucked for four hours and only busted. How many times did you say? Three? Five, two. This nigga busted every two hours? It, he just would not... Like, was it Lexington Steel, nigga? Like, why is this nigga? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Dicks it don't really work was. like that. How many condoms <laughs> did this nigga have on? Oh, mm. shit. <laughs> uh, there come with this. Nigga, who's going raw for two hours? This nigga. <laughs> Shoulders. Shit. <laughs> Shoulders. <laughs> Shoulders. <laughs> Shoulders. <laughs> that's a lot of str- friction, nigga. Two, that's 120 and, minutes. I mean, you got that tube shit in your hand. Look, hold on, bitch. <laughs> nigga, you can yeah, fly from L.A. to Seattle in two hours. Are you telling me this nigga only busted once? <laughs> in flight, fucking nigga. Nigga. <laughs> they but y'all got to re-up, though, once you do yeah, the you first one, right? Yeah, you got to do some lube. And, you no, know. you got to rest. Like, yeah, you well, gotta rest. Not I didn't want to ask you, like, what's that lube involved? But oh, that, my mind was already there going, And that was on my me. behalf. I had to. When, did you stop? I'm like, hold on. God damn. Yeah, let's get some more lube. Yeah, well, here, here's the sign. If you smell like burning rubbers, <laughs> you need some lube. If you see smoke. Yeah. Or you sm- <laughs> if it smells like the inside of a balloon. If a nigga walk out and go, you fact your smog check. <laughs> <laughs> you tear that pussy up. Oh. And we just trying to make sure, you know. But there's other dudes out there that like you. A couple dudes hit me oh, like, yo, oh, nigga nobody me. Nobody likes me. Oh. me now. Oh, okay, oh, nigga. Hey, rub me. <laughs> oh, I can't shit. see this, but I just got my shoulder rubbed. <laughs> shoulder rub. See. I rub hers too, but I need bigger hands. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> she not bullshit today. She got shoulders. She got on them 80s uh, <laughs> shoulder pads. Yeah, yeah. She, her shoulders got ass. <laughs> yeah, the Queen Latifah shoulders. Big booty shoulders, humble <laughs> It is the all new rollout show right here. Nate Jackson killing this shit. Uh, yes, he is. So Nate gonna get some. No, that's what you keep saying, Speedy. <sighs> Nate, pull your dick you out when you get there. <laughs> For the homie, pull it out. Just, well, she don't I know. think we just gotta get out more, Pam. Exactly. My dick been out. So, all you gotta do is reach over here, okay? <laughs> you thought I brought a microphone, that's all that. <laughs> Why you got jelly? Where'd the jelly go? This Where nigga they? got the jelly. <laughs> nigga, where's the egg? <laughs> oh, man, they didn't put no egg on yours, huh? You got a McMuffin? Which one did you get? The egg McMuffin, and hopefully the OG. Mm. We don't uh, have to get to the bottom. I think of I this. intern ate the egg. No, we're gonna get to the bottom. What is it? We're gonna figure this out. Anyway. So we just hoping that Pam gets him. Fellas, if you're out there, you're single, you got a job, you're a nice guy, oh, older Lord. guy. We want an older guy because Douche you Day now is 23. Listen, That's guys, not true. none of the shit Speedy just said matters. Hilarious. <laughs> We're not looking for no goddamn boyfriend. We're not looking for no commitment. Yeah, just somebody come We're looking for somebody who can come through, hit, appreciate her. Yeah. Physically, emotionally, spiritually. And the shoulder. And then leave. <laughs> yeah. And, it'd be cool if you knew how to rub a shoulder or two. Right. <laughs> He was a masseuse or some shit in junior college. That's going to pay off. And then hit and leave, right? Huh? Hit and leave. Get your ass out of She got shit to do. Yeah. We don't okay, need cool. To... Hit and leave. And you got to like it from the back. Because with shoulders like this, nigga, you need something to hold on to. She got you. <laughs> She's like a goddamn Harley Davidson. Hilarious. <laughs> this jacket is not doing you justice. These I shoulders don't know look big. Why it's so big? Then, uh, take the jacket off. I don't know. You look like Marshawn Lynch. Please take the jacket off. <laughs> <laughs> Sit up here next to Beast Mode. You already know why I'm yeah, here. It looks better now. Yeah, that motherfucker kills me with that shit. You see them niggas told her the car? He told his car? Bruh, him and Fred Jackson, the running back they just got from the Buffalo Bills, got out of practice and was drag racing right outside the practice facility. That's so stupid. Fred Jackson ran over this big ass pot thing and hit a stop sign and like fucked the whole front of his like Ferrari up. Yeah, he got money. 
Hey, Fuck that. I'm like, nigga, we two and four. You ain't got time. If you want to race, nigga, do it on the field. <laughs> right. Shit. <laughs> These niggas is joyful. I need them to sad and dedicated. <laughs> to the team. We lost three games in overtime. Like, nigga, if y'all don't stop racing. That's part of the problem. It's the all-new Roll Show. Uh, and I um, want to shout out. Um, yeah, what are you doing over there? Mind your business. I <laughs> um, want to shout out Kente and RT. They had better shit to do today. <laughs> so. Apparently. That's mine. Are you going to take my egg? <laughs> Y'all just gonna endorse me like that in my fucking time. Thank you. Well, that's the new dude. Yeah, that's him. Yeah, new dude don't know. He don't know the rules. Yeah. Man, fuck Kente Scott and RT Stepper. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> With a big, long ass dry dick. Oh, God. Oh, right. oh shit. Right. <laughs> shit. No, th- those, are my, those are my dudes. But shit. Listen. When it comes down to Egg McMuffin or them two niggas, I'm going to be focused on the muffin. <laughs> <laughs> Big nigga yeah, muffin. it don't look like you missed the muffin. No, nah, I didn't, but I'm dropping weight. Uh, uh, but this is going to happen. Are you losing weight? I found it. It's right there. He got a nice little uh, bracelet. Hilarious. He got I a get... nice little bracelet on. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to. It's a, little, it's a little girly, though. It's a little. Nah, man, they got the big-ass balls for the girls. They told me this was for the men's. They lied oh. to you. Well, nigga. <laughs> They're like my daughter wore that. Let me tell you something. Took it from her playpen. This shit. Hoes be magpies, nigga. All I gotta do is be like, yeah. So then I, uh, nigga, you seen the shining in Oceanside? I didn't see it. This first nigga, this shit hit the stage lights, and people like, this nigga got money. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should listen. <laughs> <laughs> and now, if you need him to cut your glass open, he just <laughs> hilarious. Y'all want to break into a bank? <laughs> I'm drawing circles on the wall. <laughs> Punch the dude. Uh, so if you wasn't doing stand up, Nick, what would you be doing? I'd be promoting. Oh, really? Book club. Mm-hmm. That's so what I'd be doing. But but originally from Seattle, yeah, originally from Seattle. I thought you went to UW. I don't know why. I th- I nah, man, know. I went to Florida Memorial College, Washington State University, and Eastern Washington University. A Q, right? I'm a Q. I cross the Washington State University. Oh, the you're zoo, a Q. Chi Alpha Alpha. Oh, Are you? my boo is a Q. Quit trying to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, boo is a Q. The flag football nigga. Why are you yes. calling boo? Who is he? <laughs> What's huh? his name? Who? She I'm won't not tell saying him. no names, she man. Like, we ain't seen no, a picture. Just tell me. We'll lean back. A lot legs. of people think this person does not yeah. exist. We haven't seen a picture. Who, who's the football player that had the fake, the imaginary uh, oh, uh, girlfriend? Place for uh, San Diego. Oh, uh, Mateo. Mateo. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Man Tateo. Right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we think that's you. He got catfish. <laughs> Hilarious. Well, if he's a Q, yeah. I'll know the nigga, and then we can validate whether or not he exists. <laughs> <laughs> And I can tell you why you're not getting more dick or something. I can get to the bottom of this. Maybe shit he for just you. became a Q. Maybe he's a Q U. Hilarious. Maybe he's a BBQ. <laughs> you stupid. That's funny, and Maybe I don't even know why. He's a small letter Q. Maybe he's a small letter. He's a lowercase Q. Okay. Lower Q. Maybe that's what he is. Oh my God. How long has he been a Q? I mean, uh, where did he pledge? Um, I think uh, one of them schools he went to. On <laughs> <Shit. Nigga. laughs> Shout out to I don't know him. Look here, <laughs> he be fucking. <laughs> I know he did. I don't know which school. I keep though. forgetting every He's time. Listening every time we he ask just you. asked me, was it Nate? On, was that Nate? I said, yeah. Oh, he knows you. He does. Where did he ask you that at? He just texts me. Let me see the I text see it right here. I'll be I'll be private. Uh, well, you know. Listen, her 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 login code is um. Uh, hold on. Was it you have the, nigga, his name is saved as bruh. Is that as, Nate? Oh, as yes. Bay. He's a bruh too. But I don't know, um, bruh. <laughs> he doesn't know any flag football players. No, I was looking for a name to be like, ah, oh, but she literally has this nigga saved as Bay. So all the text messages <laughs> Absolutely. are coming from Bay. I know, I know I have my dudes much. in code name. Hell yeah. Like what? Get naked um, one before. Is, <laughs> one's name is uh, Nappy Brown. Nigga, why, why, he get, why that? Is shit nappy around him? He got the taco meat around his dick. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Uh, it has to be that. You save him as It's only... not that. Um, and then chocolate chip. This sounds like <laughs> you naming these things after their dicks. Wait, I want to hey, go back to nappy dick. dick. Yeah, little chip dick. This nigga had a nappy ass brown dick. <laughs> hey, nap. Right. Hey, nigga. <laughs> and then, of course, dishes. Oh, well, we know what dishes is. I don't. Know. This nigga that washes your dishes? No, no, she wouldn't it. wash it. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the nigga with the real pipe. Yeah. <laughs> I wash all oh, that nigga's dishes. I wash a cup with m- lipstick on that motherfucker, too. <laughs> yeah, if they wash your dishes, they like you. That's yeah. funny. Yeah. Women don't just come in your kitchen yeah. and wash. 
Yeah, that's like washing your clothes. He don't yeah. do that. He got love. Yeah, but Pam, she takes care of. She pays dudes rent. You know, so it's I don't. <laughs> he, he, lies. he got new rims on his. Uh, if he's an Omega man, I'm for all of that now. <laughs> <laughs> do what you got to do, brother, to get your life right and uplift each other's relationship. Okay. Get her a shoulder rejection. How long have you been? Uh, how long have you? When did you cross? Or how do you? Uh, cross? Spring 03. 03? Yep. And what made you do up. that? Uh, man, I had some I had some major influences in my life at a young age of like grown ass Omega men, mm-hmm. and so when it was time for me to go to college, it was unequivocal. I was like, I'm gonna be a kid. My daughter uh, is pledging. She just uh, starts. She's gonna be a- a- AK. Pretty sure you shouldn't say that. You fuck around, get her whooped. Just let her become an AKA yeah, then announce it. To, no, they she, have all these rules. Is she an AKA now or is she online? Speed it on nothing. nothing about What's that school? life? I will not. Exactly. So there you go, Speed. Get in trouble, it. motherfucker. <laughs> he done do announced it. it on the show a hundred times. But I won't do it a hundred one school. time, apparently. Well, now you know. Just once she becomes an AKA, you just, you, that's when you shower her with pink and green gifts and love. Because and, she's going to join a whole new world that you may not know a lot, a lot about. I do. Well, then there you go. Yeah. I don't Thank think you do. I do. I was gonna join. But what was you finna be? What were you gonna be? Uh, uh, I wanted to be. I wanted to be. Uh, when did you attend college? Hilarious. I, the the you, disrespect. I went to tra- tone? Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. No. You wanted to join, nigga. They don't have those at community college, sweetie. Well, yeah. this back when everybody was joining here in LA, it was like a little fad. LA's a fad. We we go through shit. And next thing you know, everybody want to do it. Then ah. And at that time, everybody was trying to be, and, and mostly it was cute because it was, uh, not cute, it was uh, Sigmas. Oh, really? The Sigma house out in uh, Crenshaw. So a grad chapter? Yeah. Okay. Well, no, no, no. I, this, I was in college at the time. Where at? At uh, Tech. Okay. Really? I went to Trade Tech, motherfucker. Don't stare at me with all the forehead. Do you have your diploma? That's not what he asked me. <laughs> <laughs> Is this, and didn't you take the money for some sh- tennis shoes or something and go shopping? Yeah, that's the, the right. Number? Speedy took his financial aid, aid and went and bought some sneakers. Okay, so did back, everybody else. What are you supposed to do? With, you get your scholarly then, check and you wall out. Yeah, back then, they, they called me to the office and said, here's your check to go get your books and stuff. And I said, a check? They gave me 2900 At the time, I was 23. You can't get no 23-year-old. 2900. What was you supposed to do with the money? I went straight. Well, now they don't do that. They just send it to... Uh, Student to the student store, okay, and but then you, you still use get credit. bread though. Yeah, but 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 this they was for the difference. books. Yeah. Oh, okay. Because they got Flomo. Oh, these niggas was driving by Chevys and shit with their scholarly <laughs> check. <laughs> <laughs> niggas, they had a FBI investigation at our school. Niggas was getting the scholarly check, going to the registrar and buying grades. Hale- what? Oh my god, <laughs> nigga! For like twelve years, some registrar a hundred dollars for for a grade, like a, a B C D. A, a was a hundred. A B was like eighty. Like they had a pay scale. Let me make sure I got this right. You didn't want me to say shit about my daughter might be in something, but you just told on everybody. Nigga, they already went to jail. I would ask you. No, no, listen. You just told on everybody. The feds already came in and so did what all, they needed to so do. So it's already done. It's already done. Okay, cool. Nigga, it was so bad. They was like, if you only change 10 grades, we're not worried about you. I was like, nigga, <laughs> here I am in class devoted to my little education. Did you I'm graduate? Like, yeah. I graduated from Eastern Washington University. Oh, okay. You came back home. Yeah. It was too crazy, nigga. Nobody was in school. For, like, they were buying grades and smoking all goddamn. Like, you should have seen this shit. Speedy, it was outrageous, nigga. It was niggas literally freestyling in the parking lot for eight hours. Damn. And then saying, I went to school. And having straight A's. Nigga, they got caught because the valedictorian got passed. And he wasn't really one. Oh, a nigga passed the valedictorian who had earned her straight A's, had like a 3.95. Oh. A nigga had bought a 4.0. And so That's like, how they got uh, caught. It didn't measure up. Yeah, they were like, "How the fuck you pat? Like, you know who the valedictorian is, nigga? Sophomore year, like, ain't nobody catching this bitch unless she, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Damn. So, so did, did you go to college? I Poetry? went to community college. So no. <laughs> <laughs> you went to a satellite high school. No, you know what? I have to. I, I have to admit it. And, and I tell um, I, when satellite I do speaking ice. engagements, I tell young people all the time. Out of my biggest regret is not going to college. Um, I was in the music business. I felt like I didn't need to go to college because me too. I was already in radio. I was already doing my dream. But as I became an entrepreneur. Then that's when I said, damn, I should have went to college. So you should have went to college. Yep. You can still go back. It ain't too late. Yep. You can live in the dorms But you know what? Now in the internet <laughs> age, you can you really can learn a lot just mm-hmm. by reading. He and said doing you can researches. live in the dorms. Yeah, you can go back and have a whole <laughs> undergrad experience. <laughs> Take a whole bunch of little young niggas down. <laughs> New names in your phone. <laughs> 
Candy corn. <laughs> no, but donkey that is Kong. one of my biggest uh, regrets is that I didn't. You said Donkey Kong? Yes, you go, don't, <laughs> don't worry about Donkey Kong. <laughs> that nigga get it done. <laughs> but hey, a lot there are a lot of successful people that didn't go to college. So, mm-hmm. uh, no, put your hand down. <laughs> I will not. <laughs> Damn. Speedy put his arm up. Poetry was like, nigga, don't. <laughs> You're not who I'm talking about. <laughs> Uh, miss, <laughs> miss this round, nigga. Miss this round. <laughs> uh, anyways, y'all new roll-out show. Took a quick break. It is uh, West Coast Wednesdays because we changed. It was White Boy Wednesday and somebody. But RT's not here. Yeah, so when he's not here, we we seem to. Uh, you can go ahead and play me. Um, you. What's up? Yeah, that cube in your ear. Bitch. We take a quick break. Come right back. Come on. We are back. I had to play this for the people in the booth talking about my selection in music. Fuck what you going through. What's up with her? She hey, bad. Hey, 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 Don't do that. Speedy's so protective of her. Oh, oh my Lord, have mercy. Right. Jesus. You see, it came out of nowhere, Speedy. I couldn't control it. Yeah, don't taint our intern. You don't can, taint her. Taint? Yes. Yeah, you can get it being poetess, but you ain't about to get that because yeah, it ain't going to happen. No, 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 no. She will be a, well... She mow my speed, man. Nah, ah, ah, <laughs> but Speedy, you gotta understand. I'm Blake a gentleman Kent. and a scholar. I do women right, man. Nah, I can't I'm not let one you of these niggas, one. man. Man, I don't know that man. Well, <laughs> can't let you have that one. Anyway, uh, <laughs> see y'all new roll out show right here at Morris Media Studios. It's your boy Speed Doggy Dog, funniest motherfucker you ever gonna meet. Mm. So you can't, I can't go to the movies with her or nothing. Mm-mm. <laughs> Mm-mm. No. What if you there? What if you like a chaperone and shit? You two seats over yet? Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Over and to the left. You could be right there behind us. <laughs> <laughs> I said no, Nate. <laughs> Shit. Too young, man. She just got on this earth. How old are you? She just got She's on this brand earth. Brand new, 22. Nigga, that's my speed. No! <laughs> I mean, she'd go for all the tricks. Uh, nah. Just, I had to go somewhere last night. She not. Okay. She's not fucked up yet. Are you trying to fuck her? <laughs> no, nah, like I would rather have an unchanging situation. <laughs> we all a woman that's all bitter and niggas ain't like, shit, but her, rah, rah. I don't need that. <laughs> Twenty two, she's like love still is real. You like, take your clothes off, put your shit back on. Really, I thought I was impressing you. Now I'm going to twenty two. Yeah, she no, still we gossips, nigga. She told the truth. Like, girl, let me tell you what I heard. <laughs> he cooked, <laughs> right? Yeah. What he make? Burgers. <laughs> Some real shit. Burgers. Mm-hmm. They were stuffed, girl. Mm-hmm. They were stuffed. <laughs> he stuffed put... you, girl. No, he a gentleman. <laughs> he left right afterwards. <laughs> he he cooked for me and then left. That's what football. Like. Now, flag football keep hitting you. What the fuck? None of y'all's business. Listen, I can vouch for you, though, that the nigga does exist. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> or somebody te- texting exists. No, you right. said That's she what... texted herself. <laughs> yes, and she saved her uh, bay and her, is her own phone number. She texting herself. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, it is now time for... The Poetess Report. <laughs> you like the rhythm? You see, he's all there. All right. What you got for us, P on Weird Wednesday? Um, these nuts. <laughs> you got nuts? Oh, they in your your nuts inside. Shut up. <laughs> that's up. They didn't fall. Had they failed, you be Frank, <laughs> not Felicia. <laughs> is... You be poet, not poetess. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> so when that nigga took his pants off, nigga, I'm a, I'm a boy. <laughs> that was the best line he ever. She's like, let me let you niggas finish with this fuckery. Yeah. <laughs> what you got, baby? So the uh, some white folks are pretty upset about uh, Star mm. Wars Seven. <laughs> you know for what? The black leading character. It was so weird. They talked about this on CNBC, but they they didn't say it like you saying it now. But they were like, well, you know, people are upset about the the lead character, and he did it like that. Which is the brother. So the lead character is... One uh, of the lead characters. Okay, he's one of them. Not the one that... We'll <laughs> no, he's one of them. They said the he looked like he came, come from Amistad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he like, whoever cast it is went to Africa again. Yeah, it was like, we need somebody with a broad nose. <laughs> <laughs> we want an unknown Negro to be Hilarious. in space. <clears throat> I, well, I, I'm fine with it because they wasn't... I mean, 
They said trying to say well, no black people in space. No, the original Star Trek. What's his name? James Earl Jones. You talking about Star Wars? Dark, Star, Star Wars. Wars. I meant. But they never revealed who That's it true. really was. We knew it was James Earl Jones. Yeah. That's why at the when end, Billy D was part of Star yeah, Wars. Yeah, they've had some cold niggas on there, man. Yeah. 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 Billy D. They did. Yeah. They had Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah. These white yeah. people better get with it. Yeah, they they don't want to. They Everybody gonna be black. Yeah. But they weren't the lead characters, right? He's one of the lead. Yeah. So. Nigga, they been with the lead. One of the main characters that shit is black. Nigga, Darth Vader. That's a nigga, that's man. <laughs> Until they took his mask <laughs> off, and then it was the white. It was an old white dude under the mask. So he's like, no, it's James Earl Jones. They wouldn't use. They used James voice, right? But they didn't use James face. No, nobody commented. We watched it for years. Going, this a nigga in that suit. Yeah. <laughs> well, see how shiny he is. That's the, how black people look when you put the oil. This on. nigga was introducing himself to his kids and shit for the first time. <laughs> That's nigga shit. It's a grown ass boy. I am your father. Nigga, you're black. <laughs> you out, Charles. Right. But go ahead. Well, um What's his name? What does one call him? Yeah, what's his name? It's a it's a movement and a hashtag on Twitter. Mm. Oh shit. Uh, the actor, I don't know, I gotta look his name up. It's like Arjuna J. Budinabong. <laughs> but here's the thing. They they not gonna be able to do anything. They have sold out of tickets. You can't buy no tickets. Yeah, people mm, they are people out. are lined up just yeah. to see the trailer. It doesn't drop the movie don't drop to December. So so you know what's gonna happen now. Now people putting up fake things like I got tickets, buy them now. Are they, they gonna Wars start are, are they, they gonna start out. lining up? Yeah, but they're sold out. Well, you can't before. buy no more tickets online. They wow. went on sale when they showed the trailer Monday night. Oh my god! Okay. And they sold out like later during the game. Night. The yeah. fanaticism is. just I tell you fanatic. what's dope. You seen the new uh, what's the little R two D two? The little robot he, joint. He's round. Yeah, it's like a circle with a yeah. sphere with a head that just stays on top. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> but well, they they're doing this hashtag boycott Star Wars seven. Oh, that's bullshit. And then yeah. with that hashtag is white genocide. Like they're trying, Whoa. they're trying to say that all this blackness is causing black genocide. Everybody's gonna be black. That's yeah. okay. Well, they're they gonna be hurting when they come out with the Black Panther movie. They said by the time 2060, which we won't be here, uh, every, it'll be uh, every third person will be Mexican. <laughs> One out of three people will be Mexican. Damn! Wow! At, like at this Where rate, did they get this? No, they had it on CNN this morning. So you're saying that they multiply? They saying that they multiply. <laughs> <laughs> Have you Shit. seen Mexican? Yeah, yeah, they do. Shit. It's always and a all they have is girls. Of them. They have, all they have is yeah, girls. That's a lot of women. Yeah, they have a gang. It's like yeah. you see them, it'd be like it'd be the dad, the mom, four little girls, and one little boy. Now that's how was, the Chinese were. They had to start stopping. Like, hey, just two, man. Shit. Yeah. Now wasn't um, that's true. Star Wars. I'm not into the Star Wars truly, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. But we need to get to George it. Lucas uh, produced. Star yeah, Wars? Mm -hmm. that's create Star Wars. Mm -hmm. that's He's him. married to a black woman. Yes, right? he is. Hence, stay focused. You so, stay focused. No, I'm saying. No, I mean, people stay yeah. focused. Yeah, stay focused. Of course, he's gone. And he has something to do Posted. with uh, one of the black movies. Um, she probably was in the bed going, so we ain't gonna put uh, La Boopoo -Boo in the movie. <laughs> La -Boo -Boo. Red Tails. <laughs> George Lucas produced Red Tail. Okay, yeah, Green it's true. He put all yes. his bread up, and he made Red Tails on his own to yeah, show the story yeah. of. And it made money. The Tuskegee the Airmen. It actually yeah. made money. Mm -hmm. and it did. No, didn't nobody think it would. No. Niggas in a cockpit. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas shooting down white people. Get out of huh. here. Fuckers. <laughs> so okay. it's going to be black people everywhere. You know, the next um, the next film in the uh, Marvel series, the next character is a black lead. I know people are getting oh, really upset The Black upset Panther about from Africa. No, he's been black the whole time. He's from a place called Wakanda, nigga. He's black. <laughs> Wakanda or Wakanda? Wa Wakanda. Okay, they got food stamps. Yeah. They got, it's supposed to be like this really rich country, and they don't let nobody in. So they have, like, they've had satellites since the 1700s. These niggas been balling. Oh my <laughs> like he just don't let nobody in. And they have, a, uh, they have a rare element that everybody wants called vibranium. That's what Captain America's shield is made out of. So niggas keep trying to come into Wakanda, and he's like, get the fuck out of my country. So the next movie is about this nigga in full. White people are going to be screaming in the aisle. We going. Super nigga? Oh, yeah. Hilarious. And I've never really watched the uh, Star Wars stuff, but I'll go see this one because the brother in there. Nigga, the next Spider-Man is black. What's he called? You believe that? Nah, in, in real life, in the comic book, there's black the white Widow. Peter Parker one, and then there's another kid that got bit that's like black and Mexican. And they're about to make that movie, too. Damn. So and Johnny why, Flame was a nigga. So that's why they mad. The I don't believe mad. you or that picnic table shirt. Listen. But I believe that. Don't get mad at me because you got on bracelet. That. Look, I can All see right. it sparkling over here. Type in Black Spider Man and blow your mind on that, nigga. All right, I will. All right, let's go to the next story. Next story. Um, 
A Google employee lives in a 128 square foot truck in the Google parking lot. <laughs> That's a big ass truck. I seen it. Yeah, I saw it this morning. He has a uh, bed, a dresser, and a few items in there. Mm-hmm. But he does it to save 90% of his earnings. Mm-hmm. The rest of the earnings he has goes to his student loan or whatever. But he literally lives in the parking lot at Google. He is a software engineer. And Is he, the truck decked out? It's, it's not decked it's out. He bed, just uses it like a twin. to sleep. He got like a twin in there and... Yeah, but my thing is, he showers in Google. Yeah, he showers morning. at Google because mm-hmm. Google is a campus. I mean, yeah. it's like everything you need is there already. So yeah. pretty much, he he's like sleeping in a dorm. He just needs a pretty bed. Pretty much, but he don't have he's, no because he window. moved from Massachusetts, and he even with a roommate, his share of the rent was like two thousand a month. Mm-hmm. And oh, shit. San Where Francisco, is he standing? The Bay Area oh, the is Bay. very yeah, yeah, expensive yeah. now. And, and they they had a story about that on how they're driving because of Google and all them. They're driving the Residents, regular people yeah. out of San Francisco because they, the rent is too high. Yeah. Oh, and yes. that's only the elite lives in San Francisco. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, and that's what it, they said. That's what it's turning into a very elite city where you won't have just regular people living because the rent is entire because they're catering to these uh, these uh, uh, people that work for Google and all these different. Yeah. Um, yeah. Because yeah, they have the money taking over. Yeah. So because uh, so anyway, um, he decided not to pay. Is he a janitor? Rent. Nah, he's a software engineer. Oh, no, he so eating. He can't be. He's broke. eating. And he's eating at Google and probably free. Mm-hmm. So he found a loophole. Yeah, he did. She's like, but all the thing I need is, is a bed I and somewhere know, to put my clothes. I know mm-hmm. if that was a black employee, they oh, would have moved his ass up out mm-hmm. that parking lot. It's because it's Google, not Noogle. <laughs> <laughs> here's, here's the thing. Noogle. He found a loophole, which is all I really do need is somewhere to lay my head. Mm-hmm. And I, I can take a shower here. Mm-hmm. I can eat here. Yep. So I really ain't got to spend no money. I got 90% of my income. If I In want some pocket. pussy, I'll get a room. Yeah. I'll fuck somebody in the school. <laughs> right, on <laughs> campus. On <laughs> campus. <laughs> Bitch, where you at? In that truck right there? You going to get in the back of the U-Haul? Mm-hmm. You got to climb it's through the front like seat. A, you got to climb like through the front seat. <laughs> but I'm thinking about air and stuff like that. Like. No, it has the, I'm pretty sure it has vents. Yeah. It's 128 it square feet. Okay. Guys, this is a big uh, ass truck. It's a big white truck, you guys. Okay, like do you guys ever watch uh, it's a moving truck. the show? Uh, uh, they have a show called Little Home Big Dreams. And people take these, they move into these little, and they put like all the stuff they can into a little space. Oh, I have seen that. They be living in like yeah. these little slivers yeah. of houses. So, so they did one about this guy took. Two trailers, mm-hmm. two of those uh, trailers, mm-hmm. and put them together and had a house. One was his bedroom, one was the living room in the kitchen. So it could be done. Mm. No, I mean, he only goes there to sleep, and he says that he doesn't own anything that needs to be plugged in. Like his laptop and stuff, he charges it during the day while Hilarious. he's at the office. Yeah, he, right. he his found cell a phone, yeah. he charges his cell phone, all the things he uses. He How charges, long you been there, does it say? Probably just a couple of months, six months or something like that. He's going to make it a long ass time considering he's in the parking lot of a place that has yeah. everything we he, have houses yeah. for. He can't yeah. be late for work. <laughs> they, <laughs> they got no excuse, right? No traffic. Ah, my car wouldn't start. Right. Nigga. So he don't have a car. <laughs> Well, he got the truck. He got the truck. He probably got a car next to the truck he drives. And he bought the truck for $10,000 flat out. And there it is. It's a nice ass truck. Yeah, Yeah. only a white dude could do that. Yeah, yeah, and that's and, and then boast about because actually he's boasting like I don't have to do shit because I'm eating right. here. Right, and if a black person did it, oh, he's homeless. Or or mm-hmm. or you're taking advantage. They of the would situation. put the story differently. Yeah, yeah, they would. Black guy, read the story again. Uh, black guy takes advantage of a situation. Right, right. right. We okay. pay you this much to account for your cost of living here yeah. in San Francisco. Yeah, but it, but they are they're trying to find a way to change that about San Francisco because the regular people are being driven out. Oh, this need mm-hmm. mainly mm-hmm. mainly no, they, they won't do it. Mm. Because why? Because think about it, if you own property there, why would you want rent control? If right. you can get two thousand, five thousand from people who willing willing to pay it, right. just just to live in San Francisco, right? So, I don't know. but I think it's driving out all the black people. They're so. trying to do the same here in Lamert Park pretty soon. They're trying oh, really? to talk yep. about people over here in the Crenshaw district. Everybody talking about oh, Crenshaw, but in a minute. Be number one, folks. yeah, because I got the metro they're building over here, and they are building a Kaiser and a different. Y'all about to get a professional football team somewhere over here too, mm. well, in Inglewood, uh, maybe, Inglewood. possibly. They're gonna bring two teams to this city. Watch, 
You think that's that's what they're Carson? thinking. They think uh, Carson that, and but, Inglewood. But why would you have two different stadiums? That's, that's the only thing I don't get. You got to do it. Yeah. Well, it we, can't be like what they're doing in Oakland. These niggas is playing on a baseball field. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most disrespectful shit. They should have never approved that. The fifty <laughs> yard line is literally the shortstop's position. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of weird. <laughs> These niggas got money. I like dude because he found a way through the system. Mm. See, I'm mad at that. I like that nigga. I that mean, game. hey, if he you can live like box. that, then why yeah. not? Yeah. You know, I shit. If I, I would have stayed home longer with my parents if I knew any better. <laughs> right. I try to tell about my stepson. I said, man, y'all don't understand. If I can go back home right now, I move in there. Mama, everybody in. She can live with me. That's right. why I think the Asians doing it right, man. I'm oh, from yeah. Seattle. Up there, the Cambodians live together in the houses. And it'd be like all of the siblings, they don't move out. Yeah, until, Filipinos live like that too. They don't move out until oh, they yeah. have a certain amount of savings. Mm -hmm. Then when they do, another family member can come move into that space. Mm. That's crazy. Wow. They be having two and three refrigerators I mean, and shit. That's <laughs> I'm, I'm not making this up, man. But we they all be rich. We have a call. Caller, what's your name and where you calling from? Yo, this is D from Brooklyn. What's up, y'all? Hey, D, what's what up? What it do, D? These nuts. Yeah, dog. yeah I, I do the same thing, yo. I work at I work at the KFC on Atlantic Avenue by the Barclays Center. <laughs> man, I park my deuce in the quarter. Come on, bro. In front of the, you know, in back. You know what I'm saying? D. <laughs> God damn it, D. D. Where you eat at? <laughs> you eat at work. Everything at work. At KFC, I get a bucket. You <laughs> know what I mean? Nigga, you need some vegetables in the house. In the forty. <laughs> <laughs> Saturday night, I couldn't get no pussy because of dough lot. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So, you said a dough lot. <laughs> yeah, the dough lot. <laughs> crazy. T, you crazy as fuck, man. Went to homecoming over the weekend, though. A lot Which, of cues down there. Which one? Virginia State. Oh, my boy's down there. Yeah, yeah okay. Boy, the moist one. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah. You talking about? My boy Ray. He, go, he went he there. moist? I, I mean, seen him down there one year. You saw Ray? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You said, yeah, uh, yeah nigga, you said cues. Man. You heard what he said? Oh, he said a lot of cues be at Virginia State. I heard more. Oh, yeah, new side chapter. Mm -hmm. I'm not a cue, though. Well, you said that with confidence, sir. <laughs> 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 I put a lot of chess on that. New side, nigga. <laughs> If you were a Q, you wouldn't be living in your car at KFC. <laughs> <laughs> this thing about having a place for brothers to stay. We would have took care of you. <laughs> I, I know, right? But yeah, but uh, I just wanted to, I just wanted to chime in and say and give you a little quick shout out. Thank you, brother. Appreciate Thanks. that, man. All right, bro. Yeah, All right, I'm bye. Fine. Yeah, call us up three two three two nine three 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 seven five. Is um, the to call in too? Our next story, um, Speedy. Damn. Nigga, is the studio taking off? <laughs> <laughs> I Damn, we've that's been hella loud, and we're in the south room. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, Speedy, do you have a rush card? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Did you have problems with it? I haven't used it in a while, but I used to. Oh, wow. uh, yeah, because they have this big thing now that um, people weren't able to access their money over the past, I think, two weeks now. What the fuck? Oh, two whole weeks? Yep, and um, they said it got so bad that Russell Simmons was even sending out personal emails and responses to no, people. No, nigga, you need to Saying send personal what? money. What did you say? I mean, sorry? That is sorry that they're working on it, you know. You know, that's a really cool touch for Russell to sit down and be like, man, I know these people are in a predicament. No, you it's... might have sent some money, nigga, for real. Mm. No, you can't write me no letter. Send me money. Rich I say people he might are have, the though. stingiest people ever. Man, if, people, people. if you got a rush card, you ain't looking for no whole bunch of money anyway. You're like, look, nigga, I just need $216. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to pay this card and get some Similac. Right, Russell got that. that. Like, yeah, he should have just given yeah, it. Yeah, thank you for using my rush card. Boom. I'll take the L. That's what he should They should have took the L. Shoot people their money, and you take the and you wait for the money. To, that way, you take it out there. Account. Being down for two weeks is ridiculous. That's a long time. Yeah, that's a long time. Yeah, since October twelfth. Damn, that's crazy. And since rush card is a lot of people have mm -hmm. you know debit cards. Everybody has it. You go to you can't even go to check cash. You want one of our debit cards? It's a lot better than that rush card. Yeah. Right. But they're um they say what is it five ninety nine per month or a dollar per use. Yeah. Um, up to uh, 10 uses. Uh, yeah, a get, dollar they, per use. That's not even counting what the bank's going to charge you when they, yeah. when you go to use ATM. Because I think they charge like $3. Yeah. It's yeah. mm -hmm. a really fast way to make your money disappear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. ATM machine. But if you got to pay something with a card, you got to pay with a card. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, but they, a lot of people with rush cards, they, 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 they got an occupation where cash is king. So And they got the new, no, I won't say new, but prepaid. you ever try to pay your yeah, card? A lot note? of people don't put their money in the bank. Hell no. Nah. Because they're scared. 
that you know apocalypse come and you can't get to your money is it's Wall Street apocalypse. We ain't worried about all that shit. <laughs> These niggas is gambling on horses. But uh, they have a thing like when you go to pay your car note or something, then they charge you ten dollars for using they do. They a do. debit card yeah. mm-hmm. to pay your car note. Ten ninety nine. Yeah. And they go, would you like to pay that? Mm. You got no choice. I guess shit. And they're like, cool, now we're going to patch you over to the automated system. And, <laughs> and they have I'm a... I'm paying 10 for a computer to talk to me? When you sign up for the Rush card, they yeah. have an arbitrary, what is it, arbitrary clause in there that says that you cannot file any cla- uh, um, class, class action, action lawsuits. suits. Yeah. That don't mean shit. Oh, so in really? other words, this little thing, this two weeks thing, so <clears> they can't. you ass out. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, no, nah, you can still go to court. No, Russell got to send me some money. Russell, no, I'm good. Do you see the money in the account? I just, you know, I have a rush card. I have another card. I haven't used my rush in a while. But yeah, I, I'd have been sick. Mm. I need that. I want you to say it, two what two nineteen. Get a similar shit. Two nineteen. I need that. Yeah. Because you know because they say that people with the rush card are usually low income people. Mm-hmm. That, yeah, you know. which means you was in line holding the line up. No, run it again. Right. And that exactly. A lot of people face you on, that. You on the phone in line? Like, no, I'm here now. You want to talk to here? They want to talk to you. Right. You thought you was in a rush before. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, put Russell on the phone because it's a problem right now. Right. <laughs> you talk to somebody important. <laughs> you ever do that? You ever call and go? Can I speak to your supervisor? And you know the motherfucker like sure. Hey, take this call, niggas. They gonna talk to you. Right, exactly. Right. You Just know say you to me. Yeah. 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 Uh, I am the supervisor. How can I help you? Right. Bitch, you ain't the supervisor. I used to right. work at a uh, T-Mobile thing. I would change my voice. <laughs> you did. Really? Yeah, this is supervisor. We're going to help you with it. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, well, the last motherfucker didn't do what I asked him to do. Oh, he ain't shit. Listen, so let me help you. <laughs> <laughs> I understand the issue you're dealing with. How can I assist you? My rush card ain't working. <laughs> Is that how you sounded? My, my rush card not working. The last dude couldn't help me. Let me see. What's your uh, social security number? I gave it to you already. Account. Okay. What's the last four? 2275. Okay, 2275. Sir, you only need $8. <laughs> $8 for what? That's what you were trying to get out the ATM, sir. The problem is you don't have a balance greater than $20 to make it worth <laughs> But I just talked to the last dude, and he said he sold a 20 on there. Fuck the last dude, okay? We already talked about this. Now, how much money you need, player? Eight dollars. <laughs> All right, that's all I want you to do. Go to your couch, flip the cushions. Nigga. Look in there. You gonna find twenty two quarters, nineteen dimes, five nickels, three pennies, a Canadian coin. We ain't gonna use <laughs> a tampon. Ain't gonna be. Can I speak to the other guy, please? Yeah, hold on. Let me pass him back. Okay. Hey, nigga, he don't want to talk to me no more. <laughs> yeah, he can't. Make, well, I won't talk to the nigga. Either. Listen, nigga, you ain't got a choice. <laughs> Hello. Hey, man, the last dude didn't really help me out. <laughs> nigga, you asked for my supervisor. I gave him to you. Now you mad. Do, do you have it's another... rush card, nigga, not Visa. <laughs> Who you think is on his phone? Do you have another supervisor I can speak to? <laughs> Let me see what I can come up with. Sound <laughs> <laughs> like the same motherfucker. <laughs> it is me, nigga. You got to go through me to get to a different nigga. <laughs> you think we organize you? We don't, we don't put you on hold and patch you, nigga. We hand a cell phone down the line, nigga. <laughs> It's always working. Hello? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good. Somebody different. Look here. Yeah, so hopefully, you know, they work that out. Russell, send them their money, man. Don't send right. them a fucking note. That's crazy. You know, that's a prepaid card. Pretty much, you put in what you get out. It's, I'm sorry. Yeah. You if you've been making a dollar per transaction, they have it yeah. to pay mm-hmm. the people back. Absolutely. And you can put no more. You can't have more than uh, 5000 in there on the card, and you can't put more than 900 at one time. You can't mm-hmm. do 1000 Wait. What? So if I'm going to put money in your card and like, say I owe you $1,000, I can't mm-hmm. put 1000 You can only put 900 I can only put 900 And you said 5000 You don't only have 5000 on the card. At maximum. At max. So how come, oh, so, so, so your paycheck could be 5000 Yeah, but. If your paycheck's 5000 you, you don't have a rush card. You don't have a rush card. Oh, That's why it's that. lower income people because most of the time you're not going to have more than, at the most I've ever had on my rush card at one time. Just for this bullshit like this, probably like seven hundred dollars at the most, and it's usually to cover one. Like you have, you know what you put the cash on there for. Like yeah. let me pay this so I can put this and pay cover this it. bill. Yeah, you know. Over and the, then too, it, it helps you because I, I know if I have cash, I spend it. If I put it on the card, I don't feel like. Does it help running. you establish any kind of credit no, line? No, not really. No. It's a card. It's just like instead of having cash, you have a card. It's like a prepaid you, card. you ever go to the uh, to the. Uh, uh, um, Grocery store, and you see the line of uh, all the, the little tower. All the little cards, yeah. All the, that's all yeah. those are. 
uh, American Express, yeah. mm. uh, Green Green Dot. Gift cards. Green they had to get dot. rid of like no. They had to get rid of Green Dot okay. because motherfuckers found out how to make Green Dots, how to put money on Green Dot without putting money on Green Dot. Ah, mm. yeah. damn it! Why the niggas always come up with the good hustles? And I don't mean the loop because at Seven Eleven, Green Dots was on fire. Yeah, yeah. somebody yeah. found out how to put money on without putting money on. Right, they had to throw the, all them motherfuckers away. I know. As soon as he pressed enter and that shit went, it worked the first time. Yeah. Like, oh! <laughs> this motherfucker hit up. Nigga, you thought the dot was green before. <laughs> <laughs> and you, yeah. was it in Africa where they always try to get over motherfuckers? Uh, yeah, oh, send yeah, that to uh, 120. Ethiopia. Ethi- no, not Ethiopia. Uh, Nigeria. 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 Nigerians, yeah. they'll find a loophole. Them motherfuckers. They good. will. Nigeria. Not all of y'all. Just 82% of y'all motherfuckers. They be getting you. Mm-hmm. What else you got, man? A man is suing for $5 million after a huge pine cone falls off a tree and cracks his skull. (laughs) Oh, that's not funny. Wait. Cracks his skull? Who is he suing? The park? The The park. The the bear that dropped it? I'm like, huh? uh, uh, Boo boo, you in trouble. Nigga, it it, it cracked his skull. Somebody threw that (laughs) motherfucker. Damn, pine cones that big, though? They make pine cones that big? Cracks his skull? skull? Um, Damn. they said he was on vacation after losing his job. Oh, yeah. Oh, he wow. trying to get them checked. Go on, get mm-hmm. some money. He was napping under some trees in the San Francisco <laughs> Park. Must be Golden Gate Park, maybe. Uh-huh. While waiting to watch the Blue Angels perform when his skull was crushed by a falling 16-pound pine cone. Yeah, damn. Where Was he in a national pound? park? Was he in a redwood <laughs> forest? Nigga, why was the pine cone so big? <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. 16 pounds? That's heavy. That is That's heavy. That's twice the size of newborn. <laughs> That's true. That's a, he got hit with, who hit me? Nah, exactly. He, he, he sued bled uh, the park and a number of government agencies. Uh, he's seeking $5 million. The guy has, um, they say, irreversible brain injury. Wow. Shit. And he's only in his uh, 50s. Uh, he <laughs> had two only. surgeries uh, already. Over. <laughs> I'm about to have a hot next six years. <laughs> <laughs> spend all that money now. Put that shit on a uh, rush card. Right. Put it on a rush card. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> That's how, great. He's going to get paid. How can you sue a tree? You got to sue the park the tree. They right. say yeah. the pine cone comes from a bunya tree. Bunya pine but tree. Someone has they said to... whose seed pods can weigh up to 40 pounds. Spell bunya. <laughs> B-U-N-Y-A. Here's the thing. In order to sue someone, it has to be someone. So, so in other words, they should have cut this down is what he's saying. Mm, I don't know. That's almost like a freak of nature type yeah, accident. Yeah, because otherwise you're saying that the park goes around, cut these things down so they don't hurt somebody, and they didn't for you. And that you got one hit. time. Yeah. Well, they probably should. Those are dangerous if they're that heavy. How about right. not sleeping up under that tree? Let's if they dropping 16-pound well, no, bombs, nigga, you got to. God damn. damn. Let me see. Yeah, this nigga's gonna get paid. Let me see. What's the size of this pie? D- oh listen. Oh my God. If you're thinking of like a. Uh, oh shit. Yeah, those are big. Washington State Evergreen style fir tree pine cone. This ain't no goddamn. Just, this is oh. a cannonball. This is the look size like a, of like mm-hmm. a pineapple. It looks like a like. bowling ball. Yeah, yeah look, and it looks heavy. Heavy. They, they do say that they're. I think they meant it. Looks like a watermelon. I bet it's you not airy like either. I bet you this, though. I bet you put that in your car. It smells good. <laughs> Long time. Right. Long, Long. Long. What's in the back? A pine cone. They now. said it was like getting hit by a falling bowling ball. That's what this is. It looked like so it he was watermelon fucked up. to me. Yeah. He, but they're like a foot across. So here's the thing. Who's helping him with the lawsuit if his brain fucked up? Mm. He can't think. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'll be here all day. I'll be here all day. <laughs> <laughs> I don't and miss. that's it for the Poetist Report. You got Damn. some sports, Speedy? Yes, I do. Yo, it's no, bigger no. than a pineapple. Yeah. That's what she said. Yeah, it is, pretty, <laughs> yeah, it is bigger than... <laughs> oh, so loud. What in the I'm sorry, it's my fastest. Do it again, so do it again. Oh, okay, Sports see. Center. It's now time. Yeah, we be we steal people's shit and just make it up. <laughs> and in baseball news, it's pretty much over. It's pretty. The Royals uh, beat the Blue Jays 14 to 2, taking a 3 1 decisive lead in that one. Four games when the whole moves on to the World Series. It's pretty going to be the Royals. And the Mets beat the Cubs. Cubs had action at this fucking game last night. I watched it 5 to 2. And it's pretty much over for the Cubs, even though. People felt like this was the year for the Cubs. They'll probably have never have another year like this. Uh, I would. It's probably going to be Blue Jays and Mets in the uh, World Series. Too bad. 
because uh, you mean Royals and Mets? Royals and Mets, same thing. Uh, probably in, in the what you call it. and in, the, in basketball news, <laughs> my Clippers whooped the motherfucking Golden State Warriors ass last night. It was preseason. I don't go fuck. Shut your mouth. Well, you know. <laughs> And and uh, little yellow boy didn't play, but I don't give a fuck. Don't oh, matter. It we doesn't won. count if he didn't play. Yeah, we won. Don't matter. Mm-hmm. Uh, the real season starts next week, ladies. We apologize, but it's sports heaven right now. Baseball, football, basketball, everything, hockey, all that shit's playing right but now. But your team lost in baseball, right? They're out. Dodgers, fucking Dodgers. Man, man I thought they were going to do it. I thought the Dodgers were going every to do year. it this every, year. Last year they should have did it. This year, no, not, not every year. Shit. But nigga, this year and last year, y'all look nice. And in baseball, because the season is so long, nigga, and when you have good seasons like this, it's hard to duplicate. It's hard to take because you just felt like a winner for 157 games. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then you lose some bullshit. But anyway, uh, the biggest story right now out is Louisville. Uh, Coach is under fire there because of a uh, they find out, which I'm pretty sure happens in all schools, uh, that the basketball players were being lured. The recruits were coming to the school, Mm -hmm. and uh, the some of the coaches there. I want to say one of the coaches or something like a coach was hooking them up with a prostitute and she was, you know, oh, damn. to get them to go to school. Just like in, uh, uh, <laughs> what was the movie with Spike Lee? Uh, uh, he Got Game. Yeah. Same shit. Come really? on. Yeah, I know that. Come on. Uh, like that doesn't happen. They, they just got caught. Pretty they, much. Got, they got caught. Mm-hmm. And, but the, the bad part about it is that the coach has is, is been going on for four years. Oh, really? Yeah. They for just four the years. For the and the coach said, uh, Nick uh, Patino said, I don't know what happens. Because Nick said, I'm only there during the season. Mm-hmm. Other times I'm in Miami. I'm not there. And they like, nah. Maybe if it was going on for a few months, you wouldn't know. But for four years. And the young lady just came. And, and supposedly the young lady, her mom, is, had been taking notes. That because, you know, she said, my daughter's been fucking these dudes for the last four years. Oh, really? So she got dates, times? Yeah. The mom was pimping the daughter much, out? But she, they about to get in trouble because uh, they're going to wow. flip the script on that. Let me tell you something. There's a few people at fault here, and I don't know if it's any of the recruits. No, because everybody knows to get down. You get there, and all of a sudden, hey, here, here's Pam. Right. <laughs> <laughs> she likes flag football. Exactly. exactly. She came through the door, exactly. turning sideways so her shoulders don't hit the side. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. I'm Pam. Here's who's at fault, man. If you are a girl... And you attend Louisville. Are you watching them on the Final Four being playoff contenders every single season? What you mad about? Why ain't you fucking? <laughs> they shouldn't have to pay nobody to come in and fuck. Not like, there. these are the recruits. There's plenty of universities that got set outs. Mm-hmm. And when the recruits are like, look, y'all make them feel good. Have them niggas and come that's, here. That's the code word. Make them feel good. Yeah, show them a great time. <laughs> show them a great time. And that she got a true. miniskirt on. And the cleavage is all out. Exactly. And In fact, they he, even got a bypassy to give it to these niggas. Yeah. It's a, it's if a anybody's shame. ever watched the movie, he got game. Uh, uh, Spike Lee pretty much depicts that whole scene when uh, when he opens the door and the two white girls is on the bed and my man and uh, Jesus Shuttleworth went for me for you brother right just yeah, in case you want to go here mm-hmm. Ray, just in case yeah, you want to go here boom he was like all right and hey, come on man that's how I get down so I don't know why they're getting brand new but I think Rick is in trouble he shouldn't be I, I do believe well he the really? coach and to say that you don't know what's going on of in course they act like he been pushing these niggas butt cheeks while they fuck. <laughs> I'm a, let me unbuckle your pants. Yeah. Get, get, get on Sex is a consensual thing between the two people having it. Ain't yeah. got shit to do with the coach. He can surround them in prostitutes. If you got a young Christian recruit that's like, no, nah, I'm not into that, then what? Mm-hmm. You can't get in trouble because you tried and he turned it down. These but, things are the ones that slid the rubber on and, and went stroke for stroke with each other, high-fiving. And within that four years period is when they won the title. Yeah. So what do you do? Now, and they, one nigga broke his calf. Oh, yeah. He, he actually got in the league. He's in the league. Yeah, they sucked him back to hell. Hilarious. Why is he too? Sucked him back, back to hell. Let me get that pain out yeah, your head. Sucked all the little marrow out. He healed up just fine. He in the league now. Hey, we know that's the get down. But anyway, so Rick is in trouble. The school's in trouble. I don't think But they got to try to figure it out. But uh, if anybody get through, Rick can. Because you know he got that. Oh, yeah. He can get out of it. He can get out Trust of it. He's not no, responsible. He's responsible if they find the, the Trent Jackson on his rush card. <laughs> exactly. Oh, he fucked him in the on gym. his statement. Did, did you fuck him in the gym? No. Well, hey, bitch. Right. Yeah, outside the gym, I don't know what going. That's the what coach I dropped. Did Absolutely. the coach pay for the hotel or the bitch? Then he's not on him. Right. <laughs> he could just hang out with hoes. I mean, you know what I'm saying? And they come around, and then what they do is what they do. And tomorrow night is Thursday night football, so make sure uh, all the football fans. Uh, tomorrow, as a matter of fact, there's football, basketball, and the baseball game tomorrow night. And tell. So, again, you can definitely get it on. Uh, last night in uh, NBA scores, uh, 
Timberwolves uh, lose to the Bucks, eighty-eight to one hundred six. Mm-hmm. Spurs lose. They really don't care about the preseason. I no, nobody cares. Them. They don't really get. They don't. They be working out one nigga for the whole mm-hmm. preseason, <laughs> trying to see if they're gonna keep. Them. Spurs lost to the Suns, uh, eighty-four to one hundred four. Uh, Tim, uh, um, Jazz and the Thunder's play, and that was a great game. Mm-hmm. Well, it got kind of boring toward the end, but Thunder looked good. Did they? The under look real. They gonna it's gonna be really hard to they beat. They always look good though. That's but I mean, issue. as long as they got out. Kevin Durant, is he back? Oh yeah, his he foot's walked. good. Yeah. Okay. Good. They said he had that gout. <laughs> <laughs> well, he had the fracture that Bill Walton had. Oh. Okay. That, that those kind of NBA, uh, players. So it was get. legit. Yeah. Okay. And it's it's the little hairline fracture that mm. you can't seem to get healed because you're walking. Right. You literally have to put that boot on, and that's the boot. Right. And. Uh, they was like, if this surgery don't do it, then it could be a wrap. But they say he's healthy because you don't want that Bill Walton one. Bill Walton shit is terrible. Bill and uh, what's the big Japanese or Chinese? Yao. Yao Ming, same one. Oh, yeah. Wow. And which was, was so a worthless. hairline fracture in the foot and it's right where you need it you, if you're going to play basketball. Right. If you're just going to go up some stairs, you're good. Right. You Anything know. flat footed, you're all right. Yeah. So you got to use your art. Yeah. It's a wrap. You're on a bike, you're good. You're okay. You're on a bike, you're good. But, uh, and that's sports with Speedy. Up in this bitch. Thank yep. you, sir. What the fuck are y'all doing over there? Is that what we're supposed to say? Did you ever notice these two look up? they like mommy and daughter? No, we don't. That's our studio door. They do daughter. look like it. Studio mom, studio door. Anyway, you want to be speedy. our um, chaperone part of this? It's going to be me and her and you and Paul of this, nigga. <laughs> like, baby, ignore the arguing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Just that, focus. That's not going to be us. <laughs> <laughs> got some music queued up, Speedy. Uh, baby, I always got shit queued up, but that's not. What are y'all in there laughing about, boy? Somebody posted a picture of a dude with a midriff shirt on. Hilarious. With no draws. With a poop, a poop bear? Yeah. Nigga, don't act like a... That's what I'm going to say to that nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shout out to everybody listening and in the chat room. Hit us up, 323-293-3375. Take a 